So about the bat houses themselves, what is it about uh, a bat house that makes it a, a good bat house? Well, there are a couple of things. The design overall is, is very, very important. And a lot of bat houses that people pick up at their local garden center or their home building store are just inadequate for the bat's needs. They are not big enough. Size is important to bats, not just the, the dimensions itself, but the fact that a bigger bat house is going to have different temperatures throughout. Temperature is key. Temperature is everything for a nursery colony of, of bats in the summer months. They want really warm temperatures. But it can also get too hot in the peak of the summer, in the middle of the day. Um, you want to give the bats a little place that they can get in this cooler zone but not leave the shelter and the safety of that bat house. So a taller bat house is going to have a high what we call a temperature gradient. You're going to have the warmer air at the top because warm air rises and it gets trapped in that box-like top of the bat house. But the bottom of the bat house is still shaded and protected and it has vents to allow more airflow. So you have a wider range of temperatures possible. You also have multiple chambers. So you're going to have a, a warm sunny side of the bat house and a cool shaded side of the bat house and the bats can move backwards to forwards. And in the case of where we're at here at this particular property, we're going to install multiple bat houses in clusters. Because even though the design is identical, one bat house might get a little more sun than the other and be a little warmer than the other, and one might be a little cooler. So we're giving them an even wider range of options to choose from. Right. That's good. Um, but what, oh, oh, can, I, can, I, can I say one more thing about yeah, it? Yeah. Cut this part. Yeah. Um, so the other thing about um, bat houses that makes them desirable is, you know, it's, it's security. Temperature, number one, security, number two. And we provide the temperature, like you say, by the design of the bat house and where we install it, but the color we paint it as well. And unpainted bat houses generally are not going to be used as often as painted bat houses. You need to have more of that solar absorption, solar heating. But the bats are looking for security. They want some place where you don't have floods or high winds. They're not being buffeted around in, in a storm. The predators can't get to them. That they're not going to have those temperature extremes. Something that, that's a little safer and homier. And those, in my opinion, those are the two factors that any bat is looking for in any roost. Whether it's a cave, an abandoned mine, or a bat house.